Seven Eleven right now. Oh. What day is it, you guys? It's the day before Halloween. Ooh. And what are we up to? <laughs> you're, like, you're like peeping. I thought you meant like, like second or something. Oh no. Just one day until Halloween. I know, that's what I thought. <laughs> We're going to a haunted house. Boo! Yeah. <laughs> Boo! Boo, my bio, look at that. Oh my goodness, I'm gonna show them our skeleton! Oh yeah! Yeah, look at, look at Melissa, like she's so wonderful. Melody and I are just, oh gosh. Not wonderful. <laughs> huh? Not wonderful. Not wonderful. Look at Melissa's side of the room. I'm always just, uh, I have nothing to say. Melody's even got spoons. <laughs> I got nothing. <laughs> you got your stuffed animals. I got stuffed animals. But anyways, ta-da! His name's Spooky. He's hot. <laughs> Did we just call her skeleton hot? Yep. What? Bones turned me on! <laughs> oh, okay. See you all very, very soon. Very soon. This is our lovely dining and living room yes. area. Please continue on walking over. Ah! Out of the haunted house. Uh, it was okay. The acting was really scary. good. Yeah, yeah, it wasn't that scary but, at all. Like, I'm all for that. I don't know. I don't really like getting I, know, I didn't expect it to be that scary. Uh -huh. I don't, it was exactly what I expected, so I just thought it was fun. It was fun to it see what they did fun, with it, yeah. and like the atmosphere was super cool. Uh -huh. Like, like the story and everything. Yeah, because it was creative. like like haunted 20z hotel, and I thought that was just really cool. And like I don't know, they, I thought they did good with what they had. Yeah. yeah. Sure. Uh huh. Because like honestly, in a college dorm building, you don't really have much to work with in terms yeah. of space and everything. So. Yeah. Sorry, I couldn't film it. Just felt, kind of felt awkward, like. <laughs> but it was, yeah. they had really good makeup. I, I was like really The surprised. cook was super good. I yes, thought that, the that cook was actually was really probably good. the scariest part to me. It was Wait, like, I don't was know. That? The, it was like the first person, like we walked in and then there was a cook standing there and then all of a sudden a light started flashing and there was a person, like they were like hidden behind a table so it was just their head and they were like screaming and then the cook was chopping so it was like the cook was like murdering them right there. It was really cool. Yeah, that was really good too. I think that, yeah, that probably scared me the most. I didn't know that. <laughs> but you know, yeah. <laughs> I, I, mean, I didn't jump or scream, but it was scary. <laughs> but it was really short. It was, yeah, yeah, yeah I think that's what I expected. Really? I felt it was just too short. Maybe like at okay. least like a two minute ride or something. Not really like a ride, but like a two minute story. I feel like it's usually that short though. I don't know. Anyways. So it's Halloween today and then Melissa's getting ready to do her makeup and then she's gonna make us all look really cool. Better than last year when me and Angel dressed up as crayons. Say how you made your crayon costume? <laughs> so uh, I like looked at my wardrobe last year and then all I had were black clothes and I was like, oh perfect, I can be a crayon. And then um, Angel didn't know what she wanted to be. So then she looked in her wardrobe and all she had were gray clothes. So she decided to be a gray crayon. So it was kind of, uh, it was kind of lame. <laughs> Because we weren't even colors. <laughs> we were just black and gray and no one knew what we were, so. I finished most of my makeup. There's still like a big... So basically the way we're making like a three-person costume is that all of our makeup is gonna kind of tie into one, so it's gonna be like this big creepy smile that like a third of it is on each of our faces. Beyond that there's just kind of some like dead skeletal-ish things going on. Um, so I'm gonna do that part, which is what I have here, which is pale face highlighting 
contouring and these kind of skeletal cat eye things. So I'm gonna do that on all three of us. And the Angel, she's not home yet, so I'm gonna do this on me and Melody and then Angel when she gets home and then paint on the big smile thing. So this is <laughs> the first one done. Are you excited? I am excited. I'm excited to yeah. look like that. <laughs> <laughs> So to start, I'm using this primer, which is a green correcting primer, which what that does is get rid of any redness in the face. So since we're trying to look dead, we don't want any redness. <laughs> shape using a fine angled brush and black eyeshadow we're just going to trace out the shape so um, you want to go like start just like above the crease kind of like halfway between your lash line and your eyebrows and just start tracing line and drag it down to make the inner corner go down further. Like this. And then on the lower lash line, that's what you're going to use to extend out like this to make your wing. And then you're just going to kind of connect everything that you've done. And 
Okay, so that's the basic shape dealt with. And then I'm gonna use this, um, it's like an eyeshadow pencil to fill that all in. So then over that, because that barely looks black at all, you just want to take the same brush as before and black eyeshadow and just pack it on the lid. And the eyeshadow pencil really helps this stick and show up a lot more opaque than it would on its own. Things I learned during my emo days in high school. When I used to wear black eyeshadow over my entire lid every single day. Really? When I first got in the panic at the disco. Uh, <laughs> so I just finished Melody's makeup. You guys saw most of that, but my camera stopped recording. So, it so good. <laughs> um, all I did after it stopped recording was I added uh, the white eyeliner underneath her eye and then packed a little bit of highlighter over that to make it uh, sparkly. I did a little bit of like eye liquid eyeliner, but it, I mean, you can't really tell because it's all black anyway. And then um, also, it's kind of a finer detail, I'm not sure if this will pick it up, but um, underneath I kind of painted on a few lower lashes and then um, added some mascara and then defined her eyebrows a bit and now Now this. we're twinning. <laughs> <laughs> so that's it until Angel gets here, so let's hope that soon. So this is where we're drawing the creepy teeth, as demonstrated on me. Mm -hmm. it's I don't know. Also, kind of looks like it could be stitches, but either way, it's creepy. Yeah. So I think it looks great. I think it looks really good. Okay, good. So basically, step one is just drawing over the entire area you're doing the mouth with like a concealer stick. So uh, mine, since I'm in the middle, is going all the way around. But since Melody is going to be the side, so I'm pretty much just going to kind of do like a block rectangle up until like that halfway point of her mouth, like this, and then the other side, since it's going to be the end of the smile, I'm only going to go from about half of her cheek and curve it down. Like, oh, this is starting to break, whoops, <laughs> ignore that. Oh, <laughs> no! no! I'm not studying for now. Well, if <laughs> your concealer falls out of its container, just use your hand. Just gonna lightly go over that with a beauty blender just so it's not quite as thick, but we do want it to be quite sticky so it'll hold everything. Go over that with the powder to set it. Run back over that with our white eyeshadow, and this time you do want to try and stay a bit more inside the lines with a small fluffy brush and really try and pack in as much white within the lines as we can. And just to make it a little bit wider, we're also going to go over that with a highlighter. An eyeshadow brush and black. We're going to put a bit in the center of the lips. And then from the corner, I'm just gonna go outwards and go through the center of all the white part that you drew. And then we're just gonna go in and draw vertical lines. So, yeah. <laughs> Do just like the top all at once and then the bottom all at once because you don't want them to be like exactly lined up because I don't know. I think it just looks a little better when they're slightly off from each other, look like actual teeth are. We don't know when this turned into a tutorial. Like, we never said that this video was gonna be a tutorial. And then from there, from all the lines you do, just kind of really lightly go on beyond the mouth. just. I don't know, because it looks cooler that way. <laughs> Going back in with the white, drag the teeth kind of up between all the black lines you just drew. I'm gonna go in, this is actually an eyebrow pencil, but I don't know, eyeliner pencil would also work just fine, but just take some black pencil and you want to 
put a little more definition in the line between the two rows of teeth. Just make that a little bit darker. Maybe kind of fall out with the curve of the teeth. If, if you've drawn bigger teeth, go ahead and, I don't know, curve it so they have a bit more shape to them. And then also kind of at the tops of the teeth around here, you can kind of darken that a bit and kind of make it a little less straight up and down. Do I look cute? And then I'm gonna go over that a bit with more black eyeshadow with a small eyeshadow brush. And then also since this is the corner, I'll take liquid eyeliner <laughs> and at the corner, just to make it a little creepier, we're gonna draw some kind of cracks. I think they can be really messy, so don't really worry about them being neat, but just kind of draw some zigzaggy lines. You just kind of flick your brush around. Yes. Define the corner a little bit better. Okay, so that's how you do the corner. <laughs> Ta -da. Then, is, it, is it done? Okay. Yeah, side by side. Boo! <laughs> Hi. No. Okay. Moses well, in the middle. There we go. Here is the final product. <laughs> so yeah, creepy smile. It goes mm -hmm. across all three of our faces mm -hmm. with dramatic eyes. Mm -hmm. And we're wearing all black as well. Be scared. <laughs> <laughs> Going to a Halloween party right now. Yeah. Melody's friend. I have no idea what it's gonna be like. Uh, but <laughs> lots of nerds. <laughs> yeah, that's what I heard. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> right? Like, cause I could hold my phone from it out here. Yeah, but what if what if you're like over a ledge? Yeah, like, when you do that. On a cliff. Oh, do you have to like? <laughs> this is really inconvenient. Yeah, to... it is. It's really hard. There. There are probably better ones. <laughs> Angel, get in the shot. Oh, this is oh, recording. I'm tired. Wait, you're Good in thing. the shot. See? Hello. <laughs> Hola.